Uh, so I'd like to return to what Peter said at the beginning, that there are two ways to be a woman. One is that you're female and the other is that you dress as, uh, in the way that females do uh, <coughs> conventionally. And I think that's what he means by gender identity. Um, I, I think that that's a profoundly sexist thing to think because it means that if a woman doesn't dress in a woman's way, she has cast herself out of womanhood somehow. I think that thinking these ideas through to their logical conclusion you either accept that there are two sexes, and I think Fiona's question was very well put, that, uh, you know, and, and, and Peter didn't answer it, I note, that if we allow women and trans women into a space, does Peter accept that that space then becomes mixed sex? Mm -hmm. Because Peter says that sex and gender are two different things. Yeah. So the argument that there are two ways to be a woman, and one of those ways is something about how you identify or how you dress, and that that should allow you into the spaces that were intended for female type people. Mm -hmm. That is an argument against all single sex spaces. Yeah. And so when Peter says that he compares this with you know, black rights, civil rights, or gay rights, or whatever, what he's saying is that there should be no single sex spaces mm -hmm. under any circumstances. Mm -hmm. Because it isn't about trans women, because there is no natural category trans woman. A trans woman is a man who says he's a woman. <laughs> and any man can do that anytime he likes, and he can make that declaration, and he can unmake it as many times as he likes. So unless you accept that there are spaces that are based on sex and not on this gender identity idea, which seems to be about how you dress, then what you were saying is that female people can have no spaces and no boundaries that exclude all men, or males. I find that an idea that is extremely <coughs> outrageous for two men to sit here and tell the only woman on this panel. Because the only reason that I wanted to have female-only spaces is because I said no. And we know from polls that most women agree with me, in fact. Because when you do the polls and you explain that what a trans woman is is a man who identifies as a woman, most people will tell you they don't think those people should be in female-only spaces. Which is logical, because they're not female. <laughs> they aren't female spaces if they've got men in them. So, I, I'm sorry, I'm not really very interested in when, whether Peter says that trans women have been using our spaces for decades. If they were, they shouldn't have been. Yeah. Yeah. We never said that.